Hello, JHS parents, students, staff members, and Jacksonville community members. Welcome to another episode of Good News at JHS, this time for the week of April 10th through April 14th. So let's get right to it. First off, want to give a huge shout out, congratulations to both our JHS soccer teams, the Indians and the Maidens, both set school records for the deepest playoff run in school history. Our girls maiden soccer team advanced to the regional semifinals last weekend in Tyler, and our boys made it all the way to the regional finals last Saturday also in Tyler. Both teams, district champions, the boys I think shared the district championship. We are so proud of how these athletes and their coaches represented not only our campus here at JHS, but our school district and our entire community of Jacksonville. So please join me in congratulating our Indians and Maidens soccer teams on an absolutely stellar soccer season this year. Also wanna give a big shout out to our newly certified clinical medical assistants, Itzel Mendez, Jocelyn Perez, Alexia Guerrero, and Evelyn Sanchez. There are new CMAs, great job, health science teachers and those four students. Also wanna give a shout out to our JHS Theater Arts Department for winning an improv prize at last week's Epic Waters competition in Dallas. Great job, thespians. Our choir members, Tatiana Dengat and Angie Perez sang the national anthem at the county show last week out on the loop. Great job, those JHS choir members. And finally, our JHS student council members, Saga Umbison, Natalie Tavera, and Emily Hernandez. These students came up to school this past Sunday and helped decorate the halls for our awesome soccer teams. Thank you, Saga, Natalie, and Emily for giving up your time to make our soccer teams feel loved by our school. Parents and students just want to remind you that Progress Report 7 ends this Friday, April 14th. Those grades are due in our teacher grade books before 8 p.m. the following Sunday, April 16th. Also want to remind everyone as we get closer and closer to the end of the school year and the end of term four that our attendance incentive is still going on. Remember, in order to qualify for that attendance incentive, students must meet, must meet the following requirements. They must be passing all of their classes for the spring semester, that is semester two in Skyward. They can have no more than three of the right kind of absences. Any questions about that, you can please call our attendance clerk, Ms. Mary Carol Brown at 903-586-3661, extension 7063. No more than three absences for a whole day or a partial day. And the final thing, no out of school suspensions. So one more time, to qualify for that attendance incentive, students must be passing all their classes for the spring. No more than three whole day or partial day absences. Any questions about those absences, please call us. And finally, no out of school suspensions for kids who hope to be exempt for their semester exams this spring. That's it for this week of good news at JHS. Hope everybody has an awesome week here in April. Thanks everybody.